Welcome to North Carolina Weekend. I'm Deborah Holt Noel. What started as a lark two years ago in the little town of Mayadan has turned into a fall event. That's when the town decided to decorate a few hay bales to celebrate the season. Now Rick Sullivan has discovered that Hayadan is a must see in Rockingham County. When the town of Mayodan began its pursuit of a public arts program, the first baby step was to commission the construction of a hay bale sculpture. We placed one hay bale out on the street corner and one of my public works uh, folks decorated it at Easter time as a rabbit. And we didn't say anything about it, we just did it. And we watched people all day long stopping there and taking pictures and we thought, we may be onto something here. The town didn't wait a year to put the plan into effect. The locals were excited to jump on the idea heading into fall, and Hayodan was born. We got businesses to sponsor different hay bales around town, and we went from 12 businesses the first year to now we're over 50 hay bale creations, much like the one you see behind me. The Hay Digger is a spin-off of the famous monster truck, the Grave Digger. Joey Hootie is the artist, and he was also the creator of the original bunny that spun into this Hayodan thing. Well, we started out with, uh, we wanted to build a public utilities truck, and we came out here, set everything up, and got to painting, and then our creative minds just turned it into a monster truck. We wanted to be sure that uh, it was the toughest looking hay bale out there. It might be, but there's some good competition. The displays are located at businesses and multiple locations around town. The hay is supplied courtesy of the town and it's available to anyone who wants to be involved. I always try to do something that kind of promotes my business in a way. That's why we have the little sign that says magic happens at Avalon too. Uh, these are the aliens from the Toy Story movie. Uh, it's the Toy Story Aliens. Hey Dan has generated fun and fellowship among town folks, and the extra benefit is the occasional drive-up visitors who might not have come to town otherwise. We get the benefit because they come and see the market, and people constantly stop, even though we've been here four years, and say, what do you guys do here? We're a farmer's market. On weekends, you can catch the market through October, the Hey Dan sculptures through November, but year-round, there's another tour of public art in greater Rockingham County, the Quilt Trail. Dozens of wooden or aluminum squares posted on buildings of historic significance. Property owners work with an artist of their choosing to put out a square visible to the road for reasons of their own. Pride in the community, in the county, and our heritage. A lot of people coming up don't know about tobacco farms and wheat and hay and all that kind of thing. Well, my mother's a quilter. She's 90 years old and she's been quilting since she was a little girl. So I've always been around quilts and just the thought of putting one on the barn just excited us. At River Birch Vineyards and Farm near Reedsville, this quilt is special to Paul and Christy Marshall. It's a replica of the one Paul's mother Edna made more than 80 years ago. It's a nod toward the history of the former tobacco farm and the sixth and seventh generations of the farm who today pick muscadine grapes. Paul and I got married in 1977 and his mother had quilted, he and his mother and his granny quilted for years and this was just a gift she gave us when we got married. My summers were spent on a tobacco farm, so uh, my, my grandpa uh, and dad both raised tobacco, but uh, dad finally had to give up the, the Farming and good to public work, but Grandpa's farmed on till he is, uh, you know, till he passed on. So, uh, but that's where I learned all my farming was from my Grandpa. So, take a driving tour of Hayodan in Mayodan, or a quilt tour in all places Rockingham County, and you can be sure there will be something worth stopping for. In Rockingham County, I'm Rick Sullivan for North Carolina Weekend. The third annual Mayadan Hay Bale Sculpture Festival runs through November 19th. Mayadan is in Rockingham County, and to find out more about the festival, as well as their quilt trail, go to visit RockinghamCountyNC.com.